You see what I'm saying? So much so, we food with the uh, Asian fair slash Chinese restaurants. They got a box specifically for soy sauce. I know they got ketchup, mustard, barbecue sauce specifically. That's how much we mess with. Man, I'm just, you know, never mind. After watching um, Leslie, Leslie from SNL's comedy show and how deep she went in into the auditorium. This is a small one, but look at this. Look, if I sit down to go to a show and there's a microphone hooked up to there, I'm going to move around. They're going to try to make you part of the show. I'm just keeping my eyes open everywhere I go for signs and symptoms of fuckery. I did get a real good look in there, too, to see how all of that AV stuff worked. I ain't stay in school long enough to be part of the AV club, but yeah, this right here, yeah, they're going to make you part of the show. Let it be a microphone hooked up to that. They're going to get you. Don't let them get you. Mm, be wary. I, um... I may or may not have found some lavender oil in whoever desk that is um, in the uh, housekeeping department of this limited engagement cleaning job that I have. So I'm wondering, with this lavender oil, if I spray all these seats with the lavender oil, could I be culpable, you know, for putting kids to sleep? They might get fussed by their teacher. And I'm knowing beforehand that that's a possibility, a strong possibility, right? Also, I'm thinking, because, like, we went to a comedy show at the Robinson Center. Like, this would be kind of a cool setup for, like, a comedy show. I've seen the prices in Uline, you know. They throw stuff like this away. Like, when they remodel and stuff like that. So, one dude told me, whatever you're paying for the building, probably put that down on the slab. So, you got the slab person, that's going to be 20, 30 racks. And the plumbing people, that's 20, 30 racks, this, that, and the third. But it'll be a different type of vibe. And I'm telling you, because they give stuff like this away all the time because they upgrading and doing this, that shit will be cool because it'll be different when nobody else be doing it. But I decided to go ahead and uh, knock this out before they asked me to knock it out or told me I couldn't because I wanted to investigate. So, it's kind of both like. Just looking at, like I said, I don't know what backstage is and all of that. And it's just like a, you know, but it's, it's government funded. So I'm sure it's got the regular accoutrement. This stuff right here, I don't know what kind of wood it is. Um, look like some strong ass motherfucking cardboard, but that's what I'm saying. Stuff like that. Give it at yourself. You ain't got to order it. It look halfway rigged up anyway. But let me close this shit up. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, because I just wanted, I really just wanted to play with the stuff. And then, like, clean it up is a good excuse to play with it. Spray it down with some disinfectant. I know it's clean. But really, I just wanted to play with it. <laughs> and just get a little shot. Like, that would be a cool little comedy club. That's a lot of seating. And just the building and all of that. Then all you would need is a kitchen in the back. And maybe a foyer and like a uh, like a uh, like a smoking section, like a little. It'll, it'll be it'll be super cute. But let me get it. Like I said, let me get the fuck up out they building, man, before they say something. But I'm I'm definitely finna spray these seats with lavender. And uh, if something do happen to them poor babies, uh, man, it was funny. I'm sure I was finna hit it up. Little, little things right here. So like, look, you got this little pop-up. Everybody, because everybody been to our auditorium. We all had to go to the planetarium. A couple of them was dirty, so I disinfected them. So I'm finna uh, hit it up with lavender and then probably vacuum a little bit and get the fuck up out of here. But that'll be super cute. And they throw stuff like this away all the time. They chunk that shit out, get a whole new uh, parcel from the government on some grant shit, throw this shit away. Man, that's free. And then all you need is the nuts and bolts. Make sure they keep all the nuts and bolts. Fuck around and give it to you for free, for real, if you'll get rid of it. So then all you need is a goddamn truck. And then I'm good. I'm planning to be poor. You're supposed to plan to be a billionaire, and you buy it all brand new. I'm just saying, man. Brand new, billionaire, millionaire, hustling. Seem like it could be done. I just I just wanted to talk myself out of feeling bad for hitting them babies up with this lavender oil. Come on. All right. I'm out here doing outside work for my first time in life. I just gotta pick up trash cans. But 
like we grew up with a mulberry tree. I, I think these are mulberries. Yeah. But it was like bushy and stuff. I wonder if it looked like that because it had like this, I mean not wisteria, but uh, honeysuckle growing on it. These little things are so delicious. I remember getting freaked out by a little black and white snake. Ah! Ah! And Mac Yama. Man. But yeah, look at this tree. I don't remember. Maybe our tree just wasn't that old. It was an Aunt Lynn's yard. Maybe the tree just wasn't that old. But it was kind of like weeping all the way out here. See how that canopy goes? That's super neat. And if that, look at that jumble of fucking limbs up there. Yeah. They, they good though. They delicious.